got into the, you know, sign a deal and then it was time to start working on a record and it was, we had zero slate. I mean, there was nothing there. We like just starting from, which is a trippy thing to do when you think about it. You know, not having all this leverage and momentum of making the record cycle and all that bullshit, and just getting into it. And we had John Custer in the mix, you know, got him in there and it was, it just started doing its thing, you know, like just whatever COC does, it just kind of starts creating. Custer's been with us since 91 or something, 90? Something. Yeah, what's the story? Like, how did Almost you guys, like a, how did you guys uh, hook up with member. him? Yeah. How do we hook up with John? Yeah, what's that story? I mean, that would be a... He's a Carolina boy. I, he lived in town. How did we, like, hook up with John? I just, like, he was, was gravitated, you know? Was like, there was a, a band called Cry of Love that rehearsed in the next building over. Yeah. And that was kind of... Whatever. I think we were. I don't even know what record we were working. But he did Blind before Cry of Love even existed. Yeah, so we, yeah, we I, were I, like, I forgot more than I knew. We had him before that. Yeah, so. <laughs> like I, I remember him coming to the studio and giving us a cassette, and it was like ding 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 or some shit. And he added all this crazy shit to it, and he was like, you know, he was just the Hall a, of Mountain King. He did jingles and shit for like. Have you driven a Ford lately and all that stuff? He was like one of those guys, but he was He's also a like he was a also a queen freak yeah. and just a, a ripping guitar player and prince freak and knew all this shit and could make it sound any way you wanted. And authentic. He he played me a cassette one time and it was he goes, "Can you tell this is real Van Halen or me?" And it was like, and I was like. <laughs> Damn, John, I, is this? I think it was like that. He was that good at figuring tones and wow. shit out. Totally. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, and yeah. So once we once we latched onto that, it was really fun. And so we're here years later. And, you know, he's he's definitely the. I mean, I wouldn't work with anybody else.